God bless you. What troubles you? How goes it, sir? Are you recovered? I am, for all the good it does. The boredom here. The only thing I have to read is the Bible, and the Hamish won't let anyone near me but the priest. Have you any idea the monotonous drivel that fella comes out with? This world is but a trial. Be repentant. He talks to me as if I'm about to breathe my last. Actually, he talks to me as if I were already dead. Listen, Henry, won't you come with me to the Rate Bars? I, I need a change of scene before moss starts growing on me. Why to the baths? Well, a hot bath does a man good. <laughs> it does. Which is why you can bath here any time you like. Have you ever seen Clara, the bathhouse wench? Henry, she's a beauty. If I didn't know better, I'd say I was in love with her. How much time do you want to spend there? I don't know yet, but at least a few days. Bathing in mud wraps during the day and in the evening. But in the evening, fun. What do you say? Will you join me? But what about your wound, sir? Well, I won't lie to you. It hurts like the devil. But I'd rather hobble along with a cane, howling in pain, than listen to a selection of the most boring passages from the Gospels for one more minute. Why not? When do you want to go? I shall go there right away, but wait until at least dusk to join me. I'll have company there. All right, I'll come and join you there. About our hunt. All right, all right, I admit it. Trying to kill a ball with a bow and arrow wasn't the best idea I've ever had. <laughs> it was a nice shot, though. What do you need, sir? I need you to do me a favour, Henry. Of course, sir. Good. Well, you'd never think it, but Zdena here is a demon at dice. She stripped me bare ass naked, and I couldn't even get a ribbon off her. <laughs> well, I'll rip everything off her then, eh? Good God! You do that to such a fragile flower? Who I paid for, by the way. Right then, you've got to beat Zdena at dice. I refuse to be the only one here with his ass on show. All right. Why the hell not? You? Go away! I want nothing to do with you! What kind of governor is Sir Hanush? Sir Hanush is a good lord. Things won't be the same when that wastrel Sir Hans takes over. That will be a sorry day. What's life like in Ratai? Life is good here. Even better if them damn refugees would only vanish. How do the Ratai folk get on with the refugees? Well, they have it tough, no doubt. But there's not enough room for them here. How much longer will they be living on our streets? Nothing good will come of this. What if one of them's brought the play with him? Have you heard anything about the Cumans in Sigismund's army? Don't talk to me about that fucking rabble. A soldier was saying in the alehouse them barbarians impale people on spikes, rape women. They hold nothing sacred. The filthy heathens. How have you all been getting on here? Well, Lord Capon's been chasing us around a bit and so forth. Nothing we're not used to. How about a game of dice, then? Are you sure? What would I do with two naked men here? <laughs> Let's see how good you are.
Nice! You shot. My, my! Some real competition at last! You know I'll let you win, of course. Are you afraid of wearing the spots off? That's it. You know, there's a thin line between caution and cowardice. <sighs> hmm. We'll see. You know, there's a thin line between caution and cowardice. That's it. Should I, shouldn't I? No, I daren't. Why did you... Jesus, I can't bear to watch. <sighs> That's it. That's all. Maybe you'd have more luck if you'd remember to throw the other dice. <sighs> Finished. You haven't exactly gone off to a good start, have you? That's how to roll. That's it. That's it. Huh. 
That's it. Finished. That's the way you show her, Henry. Looks like I'm the one who will be doing the show. I could do with a good soak too. Then strip off and hop in here. All right, why not? Put your clothes in the trunk. Hey! Shift over. I don't want to tread on anything vital. All right, just give me a moment and I'll roll it up again. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. That feels good. Now, don't take this personally, but I've never seen a man more in need of a wash. <laughs> I've known cow pats less fragrant. <laughs> <laughs> you certainly know how to have a good time. Here, yeah, drink. It's not terribly high quality, but it should do the job. I don't mind if I do. Give me that. That's the spirit. So this is how you recuperate from your injuries? Booze and wenches? Of course. Is there any other way? So, what news, Henry? Never mind about me. What about you? Have you recovered from our hunting adventure? I'm well enough, Henry. These baths are just the thing, and Zena here is very keen. Clara, bring some wine for the gents before they get cross. You know what, Henry? We really can't drink this local piss. Clara, my most favourite is bath made. But, but I admit it, my dear. The wine you have here is pitiful. What's wrong with the bathhouse wine? I'd rather drink the bath water. You should go and get something better. Though where? Ah, I know. In the cellars under the rat's house, there's some excellent wine that Sir Hanush bought for us. And you want me to go there and get it now? I'd be indebted to you. And a grateful nobleman is the best ally you can have. All right, then. What kind of wine is it? A silver and red, in the cellar under the rat's house. It's the last barrel at the end on the right-hand side. Get a picture somewhere and take it with you. I'd like to ask you something about this wine. What is it? Well, so I can just go there and take whatever I want? Yeah. No, not exactly. It would be best if no one saw you. Ah, I see. And this wine wouldn't be kept under lock and key by any chance? Um, yes, probably. But that won't stop a clever fella like you, will it? Which wine is it you want? The Sylvan Red. It's the very last keg on the right at the back. You'll recognise it easily. It's the only one that's tapped. All right. All right, then, I'll bring it. Good man.
Jesus, look where you're going. What the hell? Hey, watch it. So, about that wine you sent me for. Well, have you got it? Of course. You really broke into the cellar at the rat house? I certainly did. I hope that wine's really worth the trouble I had. I don't believe it. You really broke into the cellar. You're insane. But, sir, you asked me to do it. Jesus, Henry, you'd be talked into just about anything. Well, let's see if this wine is as good as you say. What are you waiting for? The parish priest's blessing? Come on, then. Get it down, you. Ah, now that's what I call a real wine. Sylvan red. It's not like that donkey piss they serve in this otherwise delightful establishment. You can tell from the first sip, can't you, Henry? Yeah, as you say, sir. Sylvan red. The taste is unmistakable. Flowers. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What kind of um, flowers do you like? Ah, uh -huh. well, I like all kinds. I like dandelions, uh. sage, knotweed, and poppies. I really like poppies. Oh, Henry, did you hear that? <laughs> what? The lady requests 
da dandelions, mm -hmm. uh, uh, sage, mm -hmm. uh, cabbages. <laughs> Right. No, no, not weed and puppies. <laughs> what? <laughs> you, you want me to go flower picking now? I know, I know. I'm putting you to work again. But if you do it, I'll give you scrivency flop and groschen. <laughs> that much. <laughs> All right, I'll go. Uh, uh, no. Save something. Liquid. Something else and roses. Yeah. What would a bouquet be without what roses? Are you doing? Some in the upper castle garden. Get going. What's going on? For security reasons. As you wish. What the fuck is this? All these things are stolen. You'll be leaving that here. Got it, laddie? Now you can enter. Mind. Come for my wench. Well, as you can see, I'm not your wench or anyone else's, so fuck off. What are you doing with my Clara, you cunt? Archie, stop that. He's just bathing here. Bathing here, is he? With all the wenches but you are whores. Archie. But are you whoring now, too? That's enough, Archibald. <laughs> Archibald? <laughs> you shut your mouth. I'm not done with you. No, I swear the gentleman hasn't touched me. Actually, that's quite true. Um, well, mostly. No, nothing happened. Nothing. We can talk about this later. First, I'm dealing with this bastard. I'd like to see you try arson balls. <laughs> arson balls! <laughs> For the love of God, stop it, both of you! Fuck you now. Hey. What do you think you're doing? <laughs> <laughs> Trying to drown a nobleman. Oh, shit. Fuck. <coughs> I, I didn't know. Get out of my sight. Go on before I remember I can have you hung. I apologize, your lordship. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Archie, wait. Oh. Whew. I nearly got drowned by arson balls. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, that's the least relaxing bath I've ever had. Fuck, I feel like I've swallowed the Baltic. Oh, drinking will be the death of you. Damn right. Is there any wine left? Are you out of your fucking mind? You want to carry on? Of course. Well, don't tell me you don't fancy a drink after all that. Greetings. What business have you? Well, what will you do with them, Sir Hans? <coughs> what, with arson balls? I don't know. What do you think I should do with them? You're asking me what you should do with the lunatic who tried to drown you? Well, he was a bit drunk and jealous. And he tried to kill you? And then me? It's your decision. But if word gets round that Lord Capon let an insult like that go unpunished, I, mean, I suppose you're right. Well, a day in a stock's never killed anyone. Might do him good. <laughs> but we had some pretty good sports, eh? <laughs> <laughs>